Now this is a VCR you don't normally see nowadays. A Quasar Top Load VCR model number VH5041-K. Manufactured on July 17th, 1984. And made in Japan. First of all, check this out. It loads in the top and you get to watch the VHS play through this little window. I love it. I actually found this on Kijiji, but it was broken, not working. But luckily I have a guy who fixes old electronics, and he was able to bring this beautiful machine back to life. And the video output on it is mint. He himself was really impressed with the quality of the picture, which I'll show a bit more later. So first we have the front panel. It's a classic old silver color with a door that flips down to show you more controls. But at the top left we have the power button which is blue. Under that you have the TV VCR button which allows you to switch from the video input or the coax antenna. Next we have the eject button, but it's looking a little faded. Over from that we have the play function buttons, play, rewind, fast forward, stop. Over and up from that we have the red record button. You have to hit the play button and the record button at the same time to record. It won't work if you just hit record. Next is the pause still button and the slow frame advance. Neat feature as you see it here. Beside that is a bunch of buttons that are alphabetically ordered. Maybe that's to program the date and also labeled 2 to 13. This being an easy way to select the lower common VHF channels. You got the display there and dials underneath the channel buttons. S, P, L, P, S, L, P, speed, slow tracking, and tracking. This allows you to get it just right. And now my favorite, a trap door. So many VCRs had hidden doors that revealed more buttons. First is a bright orange button labeled OTR, which stands for One Touch Recording. Next to that is Counter and Timer, Program slash Clock Settings on and off, Select and Set, and then the AFT on and off switch. I wasn't sure what that stood for and I couldn't find anything online, so please let me know in the comments. Under that looks like further controls of the alphabet slash channel buttons. You can change it from VHF low to high to ultra, which would access different channels on cable TV. Look at this beautiful wood grain. I'm a huge fan. I still can't get over how cool this top load pop-up is. Here's a look at the side. On the back we have the power cable, in from antenna coax input, and out to TV coax output. Next to that is the out to TV and in from antenna connections for UHF. Straight under that is the composite video audio inputs, and of course the composite video audio outputs beside that. Channel 3 and 4 remote and camera remote switches and ports. Also some warnings and the model number info. So I'm very impressed with this VCR. The outputs, like I said, are great. Definitely a keeper for the cabin.